guys, I can't believe what I'm about to say right now, but Cobra Kai has officially broken me. Not broken me in terms of like flabbergasted or angry, no. I'm talking about um, emotionally. Well, hypothetically, because I'm not really gonna let that ruin my day. But for what it's worth, and for this video, I'm just gonna say that. And the reason being is because I just watched the latest episode of season five, episode, what is it, four, playing with fire. And I gotta say, there was one instance where um, everything was going um, very well for Miguel and he wanted to make things right and he ended up um, trying to do that. But when he got there, Sam ultimately told him that she needs a mental health break from basically um, almost everything. Which I can understand from Sam's perspective because um, Sam has been through some very complicated stuff. Dealing with the school fight back in season two, having to um, cope with the fact that um, she had a traumatic experience with Tori and if that wasn't enough, um, having her um, father figures fighting all the time and making it abundantly clear to everybody that she um, isn't um, into that stuff anymore. The point is, Sam has been through a lot and um, people will need to understand that when someone's going through some things, um, it's very understandable for... Um, them to have a mental health break but here's the thing that makes it so sad it's the way she um described it because let's be honest here there's no um positive way to tell somebody that you need a break from a person and from karate or from anything to find yourself to a, a guy who you deeply care about so the whole scene in um, Playing With Fire when S Miguel and Sam meet up after what happened back in season four is just very um, emotional to watch. And I feel so bad for Miguel, man. He literally did everything he could to, um, to try to muster up the courage to make things right with Sam after he, you know, went to go look for his dad and um, he found out that his dad was a total jerk. And he, plus, um, his dad didn't even know of Miguel's existence. So now, not only does Miguel kind of have to deal with the fact that um, he is basically a kid with a father who, do, who doesn't know him, but now he also has to deal with the fact that he possibly messed up Sam's emotional state forever. <sighs> Look, guys, Cobra Kai has done a lot of things for me. It has um, been entertaining. It has been um, awesome. It has been good. But there is no reason why a um, show about karate should have that much drama in it. I mean, why can't we just have a single moment where um, Miguel, Sam, Johnny, and LaRusso, or basically anybody in Cobra Kai, can have a break from people like Terry Silver and, and John Kreese, or basically Cobra Kai altogether. But... I guess since um, Cobra Kai is a drama show, they have to um, put those plot elements in there to make it as entertaining as possible. 
So um, to everybody who wrote the show and made it as emotional as you could, you have my respect. But also my kind of dislike because I personally just really, 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 really did not expect you to go as far as you did. But in a, in a way, I'm glad you did because now we have a show that is able to um, touch the hearts and minds of everybody that watches. So um, I sincerely hope that um, Sam and um, Miguel's relationship after the um, after Sam's mental health is restored gets back into full gear because believe it or not, um, Sam and Miguel were the best couple. Um, and the best thing about that is, it's a drama show, so it'll probably happen again, right? I don't know. I just needed to share my thoughts with you guys today. Thank you all so much for watching. Good night, everybody. Cobra Kai is great, but man, is it emotional. I'll see you all in the next video.